welcome to my cooking. Today I will be showing you how to make Kashmiri Jai, which is also known as pink tea. The ingredients you'll be needing are one and a half mugs of cold water and a further one mug of chilled cold water, which we'll be using at a later stage, three quarters mug of milk, one heaped tablespoon of Kashmiri tea leaves, two star anise and three cardamoms, two heaped tablespoons of sugar, or you can adjust it to your own preference, pinch of salt and you will also need a bit of red food colouring to bring out the pink colour and crushed pistachios for garnishing. Add in the one and a half mugs of water to a pan along with the Kashmiri tea leaves, star anise and cardamoms and the pinch of salt. Mix this all together and allow it to come to a boil. Once this has come to the boil, you will need to turn it to a medium heat and allow it to cook for about 20 to 25 minutes until the water has reduced to half a mug. The water has now come to a boil. I will now reduce it to a medium heat and allow it to cook to tw for 25 minutes. After 25 minutes of boiling, the water has now reduced to half a mug. I will now turn off the flame and add in the chilled one mug of water. Aerate the water using a ladle. We'll do this process for about five minutes. After aerating this for five minutes, I will now turn the flame back on and allow it to come to a boil. I will also add in the red food colour at this point. Once it has come to the boil, add in the milk along with the sugar. Stir it all together and once again I will allow the milk to boil for a few minutes before turning off the flame. After allowing it to boil for a few minutes, I'm going to turn off the flame and your Kashmiri chai is ready. You will now need to sieve this out to separate all the tea leaves. Garnish with the pistachios and your Kashmiri chai is ready to be served. I hope you enjoyed the video. Do try it out and let me know how you got on. Thank you for your support. Until next time, goodbye and Allah Hafiz. Thank you.